hello everyone and welcome to a new vlog it is friday evening and i am so ready for the weekend um especially this weekend because it was a five day week after the christmas break for the first time like last week was only three days so this week uh definitely felt so long but it's finally done and i'm home i got home like a while back and i just went into the kitchen um kind of like washed up my coffee tumbler and everything that i took to work and then i came down now and i'm gonna go and have a bath and just relax and unwind this evening my plan is to order in some food i'm gonna be ordering some sushi and some sushi rice with veg teriyaki uh the reason i'm ordering veg is just because i really like like veg sushi stuff which is kind of strange i know i do not enjoy their fish sushi all that much i mean i don't enjoy fish sushi too much because of the whole raw situation which is why i really enjoy the veg tempura sushi and then i think like i've never really tried the sushi rice with veg teriyaki but it would probably be really good i feel uh since i enjoy sushi veg um we'll see i have tried the chicken teriyaki and the fish teriyaki and both of them are really good so i'm hoping that this is gonna be good too but for now i'm gonna go and have a bath change and then i'll also um catch you up on, on my reading i have read two books so far this year it is the 12th of january and i'm reading my third book now which i might finish tonight i'm not sure if i'll finish it tonight but yeah really enjoying it i must say all the three books have been short like they've all been 200 pages or under but i'm really enjoying the book so far that i've been reading so i'm really happy that i'm like back in the reading mood i'll talk about the books after i'm done bathing and or is it bathing bathing and when i'm like in my comfy home clothes and stuff and then i will let you know um about what i'm reading yeah see you in a bit I kind of um, did not vlog after I spoke to you last night because I was so tired. I just had my sushi um, and I was reading for a bit and fell asleep while reading. Um, and I still haven't told you what I have been reading, but I kind of am in the middle of changing my bed sheet and just cleaning my room, doing all of my weekend routine that i usually do i like to just change my sheets clean my room you know like clean my ac filter clean my shelves all of that like i don't really deep clean every weekend but at least dust my shelf so that my shelf is not dusty obviously um so i'm just gonna keep doing all of that right now and i will update you regarding the book i'm reading i will probably speak to you um in the evening hopefully i do have a few like chill plans to just watch movie at home and relax probably get some kfc so i don't know if i will be vlogging but um if i don't i'll just speak to you whenever i do and i'll let you know about the book i'm reading it won't be long for you because it's anyway gonna be like the next clip <laughs> um but i feel like i've really been slacking off when it comes to like editing videos because i've just been trying to relax on the weekends uh, since the weeks are just so busy and I wake up every morning at like 4 30 a.m And then I like go to work travel all of that like commuting um, Itself is like a long time though. I really enjoy it because I read my books, but I Get tired at the end of the day and I want to relax in the evenings and then on weekends It's like I'm getting to sleep and then I have all these chores I have to do that I've just not been finding the time to edit really and um I think that's okay so i really don't know, like how i'm gonna be um going ahead with youtube but for now i'm just like making videos whenever i feel like it but yeah i've just been thinking about like do i really want to continue making vlogs because of how like unrealistic it is for me and also like my life is quite boring i, I think everybody's life is boring though so that's fine um that is the point of vlogs i think but i've just been thinking of whether i want to continue making vlogs with my schedule that being said i will upload vlogs now and then maybe if i feel like it because i really do enjoy watching vlogs and whenever i watch vlogs i really get inspired to make vlogs but don't know how consistent i'm gonna be with it um anyway i am gonna 
get to cleaning and I'll talk to you later. Hello, happy Sunday. It is Sunday. I did not vlog the rest of the day yesterday because like I said, I had a chill night planned. We did watch a movie, me and my boyfriend. We watched um, Catch and Release. We haven't really finished it yet because I kind of got sleepy, but it's about this woman whose fiance um, dies and then she kind of starts finding out things about him that she didn't know. It is, I think, also a romance between her and another guy. I don't want to spoil it in case you want to watch it, but it is quite good. Um, also, I uh, did mention the book I'm reading, Jillian, so I did read a little bit of it today morning along with coffee and now I am, um, I think like 76 or no, 82% of the way through it, so I only have 18% left, so I will be finishing that book today, which is really great, and I might be ending the vlog, though I feel like it's gonna be a really small a vlog because I just like have like two to three clips so i might um extend it in a little bit in case i feel like it is short but uh yeah that is that i am actually ready now because i'm going out with my dad we're gonna go and choose some tiles for the balcony i might even take a few clips of the house if i go there um to add to the vlog so that you can see what's happening so far we have like the tiles put up in the house now like not the floor tiles but we have the bathroom tiles installed and then the kitchen tiles and everything which is great and they look really beautiful I haven't really seen the kitchen tiles in person because I was at work but my dad like showed me the photos so I'm gonna go and see those today which is really exciting um yeah that is that also I will be starting a new book soon which is gonna be a buddy read so me and boyfriend we've decided to buddy read tomorrow and tomorrow and tomorrow by Gabrielle Zavine which is so exciting because this book has been on my TBR it's so beautiful but it's so big like I really don't like big paperbacks but I like that it's really floppy well like look at that it's so floppy so yeah that's gonna be fun to read I hope I really don't know exactly what the book is about so I'm kind of going into it blindly but I've heard a lot of good reviews so I have like really high expectations um but that's that. I'm gonna go and get going because my dad's gonna start getting <laughs> angry otherwise. So yeah, besides that, I don't really have any updates, but it has been such a cozy weekend and I'm really just happy because every time I get time to relax on the weekend, I just feel so ready for the week. So yeah, really excited about that. Um, yeah, nothing else. I will talk to you hopefully in the evening.
Hi everybody, it is Monday. It is a holiday because it was declared a holiday uh, today as it is 22nd January and it is like the inauguration of the Ram Mandir, um, which is great for me just because there's a holiday. I'm really happy and not complaining at all. Um, but that means this week is going to be only a three-day work week because Friday is 26th January, which is also a holiday, and then 27th and 28th is Saturday, Sunday, though we kind of like have a bit of a retreat sort of a thing that I need to attend on those two days, so it's going to be a short weekend sort of for me, but it's okay because um, it's still like not a work, like a long work week. I really get tired um or five day work weeks to be very honest i don't know how i did six day work weeks last year but we don't have those this year which i'm really really grateful for to be honest but i wanted to end out this vlog because it's gone over for too long and i honestly don't remember when i started it but it is like i said 22nd january and january is going to be over in a week which is crazy to say i mean not really a week but like nine days but still it feels like the new year just started so that's that's crazy but i wanted to just and not this vlog like i said uh i did want to talk about the books that i did read so i've so far finished reading four books in january which is crazy the first book that i read was i think it was the new me by hal butler uh it was quite nice i think i rated it like four stars or three i don't remember i think it was four stars i really enjoyed that um then i read um my days at the morisaki bookshop again another book that i really enjoyed though i gave this like three stars i think because it was a little bit unrealistic I actually i'm gonna check my goodreads just now just to see if i actually rated them what i'm saying because i can't remember so i rated the new me and days at the morisaki bookshop both four stars i thought it was three then i read jillian by hal butler i'll just put up the um book cover here as well um this book it was good but i feel like it could have been better because the ending was sort of like a cliffhanger um not exactly a cliffhanger as such but the, it was not an entirely closed ending and some people might enjoy that or like that because you know that's how life is it is very uncertain and you, you don't always have an ending but i was kind of annoyed so it was three stars and then I read The Outsider by Albert Camus, which I actually had a physical copy of, but I returned it back to the library. I got that from my work library, and that one I gave four stars out of five. It was amazing. Currently, I'm reading um, Diary of a Void, which I don't know if I talked about this book, but it's about this woman who is pretending to be pregnant um, to get like all these perks related to pregnancy at her workplace and stuff. And it's kind of crazy because she kind of starts blurring her imagination and reality. Um, and yeah, so far it's quite nice. I I'm on the part, the book is divided into chapters according to her pregnancy stages that she supposedly be in. So right now we're on week 20, which is, I think, five months pregnant and... Yeah, it's quite nice. It's very um, slow, sort of mundane, and I really enjoyed that. And that's why I love uh, Japanese tra translated stories. This book is also translated from Japanese, and so was The Days at the Morisaki Bookshop. And I also want to read Before the Coffee Gets Cold, which is another book that I have on my TBR and I have a physical copy of. The right now it's with my boyfriend because he's reading it, but I'm going to be reading that soon. But um, that's about it um, for this vlog. I'm going to be ending out the vlog here and starting a new vlog soon um hopefully this week and i have a lot of plans for reading so i'm really excited i've been feeling really really enthusiastic about reading this year which is amazing because it's a great start to the year um but that's it for today hope you had a lovely time watching this oh also today in the morning i finished editing a baking video like didn't finish it entirely but i sat with my coffee edited some video chopped up some vegetables for lunch that my mom is making i just wanted to help her out and then i also made myself a green spinach smoothie and had that and it feels like such a productive day already and i'm now cleaning my room then i'm gonna go wash my hair so it feels like it's a great 
productive day so far and I realized that just starting off my day in a productive manner really helps me feel good about the entire day so yeah I want to just remind myself to do that often but that's about it i hope you really enjoyed watching this vlog or it was just relaxing or whatever um and yeah i'll see you in a new vlog soon bye take care